Hello everyone, welcome back to the game. Oh, don't you start. I haven't even left the link here, heck. Uh, I, yeah, the previous one just never really reloaded. Hey, there's another one of those things for me to try again. Uh, gross. So we'll see what they do. I just press quick restart inside the, uh, the broken lift and it's murder time. I mean, it's a shame that I never got to use that item, actually, which is really annoying, because first time I'd seen it. Uh, it's a bit, bit, bit upsetting when you just get a brand new thing and you never get the opportunity to use it. I've never seen this area before. So this is cool. I'm guessing if you, be, if you go up there, it just crushes you against the ceiling, right? So what we've actually learned is get off <laughs> the elevator thingy before it kills you. But maybe... I also felt like there was something up there that time, right? So I'm kind of not 100% on the whole mechanism here. I'm also very appreciative that the first blinking room that we found was not one where we just immediately got owned by those acid things. So I'm not sure what the noises are that keep happening. So I hope you'll forgive me for freaking out a little bit every now and then. Um, it's, it's almost making a well done on picking that thing up noise, but the last time, it, the, what the noise reminded me of was what I thought I heard when I went into a new section of the map and got a new bit of map. Um, but I don't know if I did that. So, I guess to some extent I don't need to know that. You know, I don't, I'm not entirely bothered that I've got a new bit of map. Uh, that, that I couldn't get to before or that well I'm bothered if it's a bit that I couldn't get to before what I'm not bothered about is if it's a bit that I I've just entered that is new because I know <laughs> I was there Aye! oh that made me jump this is a little bit less freaky today than it was yesterday I see it's bits of enemy so if you end up up there you're in trouble <laughs> don't don't basically don't end up up there. Don't be in trouble. Perfect. All right, I think I can get down with that. It's literally just an elevator. There's nothing special through the ceiling except for the fact that the red ceiling deads you. Don't do that. Don't don't get dead. Rule number zero: don't be dead. No, rule number one is don't be dead. Rule number zero is don't be on fire. Uh, I had to scratch my side, and I still have to scratch my side, which means I can't aim, because that's my aiming hand. If it was my other side, it would not, been my, would not have been my aiming hand. It's just the way of the world. It's the roll of the dice, it's the lay of the cards, it's the... Oh, what other chance metaphors can we think of in order to pass the time while we just race through these levels and own everything that we can find? Please. I wonder if easy mode has... I mean, I'm guessing it has a different balance. I don't know if the different balance is implemented in terms of less enemy health, less enemy damage, both. Uh, more gun drops that are not your basic gun. Yikes. That's a bit, a bit, a bit rude. Not really what I'm into. No, you should ask. Bit of, uh, bit of consent between adults, you know? Don't just start throwing enemies at me that I haven't asked for. Oh, this noise. Oh, wait, I have to press the use button again. That looks suspicious, don't you think? It's making noises. I have anything? What? <laughs> well. What? Something else exploded. I'm so confused. What is happening? Can I please pick this up without... Thank you. Dying on the... Die. Oh, there's only two food in there. Not enough food. Well, we can just leave, so that's fine. Don't have enough scrap to make this worthwhile, so I'm not going to bother with it, to be honest with you. I am stuck. Oh. Ow! That makes me sad. Still not enough. 
Now we have enough. I might as well do it now. Whilst we're not being attacked or under any sort of difficult situation, we should use that thing. Well, it, essentially we're safe, although that is probably a limited time offer. But let's get in here and hopefully the elevator will continue to work this time all the way to the next, next level. There's a merchant traveling around in disguise. If you see them, kill the monster in the area for the reward. Uh, is there? <laughs> I wonder where that is and how many levels do I have to go through to actually reach it. Is this the same every time? Is there going to be another one of them bloody things up here. No, there isn't. What? <laughs> For once, I'm not being attacked by acid, and I just don't know what to do with myself. I do not like that. Upgrade, so I'm not going to take it. Heck you. I like the fact that those things just beep a few times when you kill them. You know. It's like when they introduced the, the hit beep in Quake 3, I think? So that you know when you've actually hit somebody. I, I appreciate it in... Uh, wait, what was the first game that did that? I think it might have been a Call of Duty game or something like that. The the crosshair would flash with a, an extra cross, basically. And that would let you know that you hit the thing that you're targeting and to continue to do the thing that you're doing. Very, very oftenly reloading here. This is the pod that we found in the desert. Except this is not in the desert. I'm going to assume that that door is not going to open underneath me and eject me into space, but I would not put it past them to have that happen. I'm going to uh, stop being a douche. And... Yeah, you missed, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Do you get an achievement or a reward or something for getting through a level without being hit? I mean, obviously the reward is you have all that HP and armor left for the next level, but is there something else? I could deal with the devil or something. Actually, you fired in the direction I wanted you to for once. That is interesting. You, you put this circle over the uh, enemy that you want dead. And you pull the button. Pull the button. You click the button. And he pulls the trigger in game. And then the enemy, which fills up most of the circle, fails to get dead. I think it kind of misrepresents the intention of the circle. Hmm? If they're going to be that bad of a name, say so. Hmm? Don't you think? Too much to ask? Looking for some more aim upgrades, therefore. That, yeah, that weapon's alright, but it's it's no railgun just now. Oh, fine, don't let me through. Jeez Louise, I guess I'm going underneath there, where I don't really want to go because I haven't been hit yet uh, in this entire level. And I don't want to risk it just in order to empty this area of it. Hey! See? What did I tell you? Predicted it like it was basically guaranteed. What I did not predict is the fact that the bastard was right in front of me as soon as I got there. Excuse me. Go away. Thank you. Now I'm going to keep these extra weapons weapons is just for now because there we go um they might help out in later levels when we want something a little bit more well first of all loaded e hello i appreciate that uh that La uh, that i said to be honest with you how <laughs> how you're not that difficult to hit Maybe it's that difficult to aim. Oh, is which what? I understand. So it was inert, and then I fired through it. The purple thing was inert. I fired through it, and it turned into an enemy. It's interesting. Also, I have 19 shots with that thing. Now. Never had 19 shots with that thing before. But if you shoot through the purple things, it aggravates them, turns them into them, and then you shoot them again. <laughs> Does that? Do I have to? I guess is my question. Because I think I managed to get through the previous level without ever actually doing that. 
I am running and I'm running and I'm away and I'm running away and I'm running and I'm away and you out and you out and out. Oh, it's just a machine gun. Not very good. <laughs> Aha! We only took a bunch of damage. We didn't actually take that much damage, as evidenced by the fact that I still have armor and don't need to use the HP machine just yet. Which is grand, actually. That's, that's a whole new level of fish cakes. I feel like fish cakes, right? What damage? That's the first time for everything, isn't it? Uh, tempted by that for some more armor to keep my HP intact, which I might do. But we might get to 6,000. If we can get another. If we can get as far as 6,000 on this floor, then um, I will use that. If we don't, I will have to think about it, which means I'll probably forget. Which means I'm not going to think about it at all, which means it doesn't matter. <laughs> right? Nice. Oh, you got me. <laughs> you got me, partner. <laughs> Starting to get tempted to actually. I'm sure, I saw something. Starting to get tempted to actually uh, just take all that HP. <laughs> and the, the door hasn't opened yet, which is frustrating because, once again, thought I'd been everywhere. Luckily, this is a fairly simple layout. There's this area and there's that area. And they don't go anywhere. So, what else is there? Um, my belief is that we don't have to kill those those thingies that come out of the sort of the gas in the air, you know those jellyfish things, because we had gas in the air the other day in the last episode, I think, and we just ignored it and moved on, and then you know life was good, we were fine. So look, we in. <laughs> Um, I mean, I might have to start cutting these levels <laughs> if this if this continues because it's kind of silly that we can spend so long just looking around for nothing at all. I mean, there could just be one enemy just hanging out that I never found. I think the thing about the purple things is that if I'm, I'm saying purple things, they might not be purple. <laughs> Please recognize that I know that they might not be purple. I'm calling them purple gas thingies because I think they are. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. There's, there's nothing else. <laughs> I've done everything. Mm, there's no more baddies. Anything that can be aggroed has been aggroed. Down here? Yeah, but this is all done. It's all empty. This damn map is just useless. I think that was on purpose, but like, come on. It could be... A little bit more useful and still useless. I mean, why have it? Um. Now what? <laughs> Where now? Is there another door that I've forgotten about? There's a lot of this level. Is that this bit? Yeah. Like something in the in the starting area that I missed. Oh. Uh oh. We're going to get jumped as well. That's the thing. It's going to be... Hey, surprise. Here's the enemies you didn't kill. And they're all on top of you. Is there a button? Is there a key card? Is there a... That's the other... like, what if there's a key card that I just can't see? I have to pick something up that's fallen off of a corpse? What about that corpse down there that is an actual person? Where did you go? What's that one? Am I going mad? Am I going slightly mad? Nothing there. Is that the monster closet's trigger from picking things up? Or from going to certain places? And I, or sometimes I'm just backtracking, apparently. Uh, what about this joker? No, that's not a normal... That's not a person. I didn't go near the food thing. I don't want any food. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I will pay for this. I've decided... I will pay for this. Probably should take some ammo, some uh, arm. Uh, yeah, ammo. I was right the first time. A bit low on ammo, but uh, I just don't know. Was that 20? That might have been 20. What was that?
Go open. Go open. Door open. Right, so we pick up the key card and the door just opens itself. Easy peasy. Can't see through the smoke. Cough, cough. Okay. Okay. Ow, but also not ow. That was sort of a, a principled ow. It was an ow in in potentium. An ow that could have been, that never was. What is this? Got 25 shots in it. It could be good. It could be terrible. Let's just not use it. <laughs> because... We know what we are with the railgun. We have got plus accuracy, finally. Uh, railgun, please. Get out of here, Assassin's Creed. I'm going to continue to call Assassin's Creed. I'm not sure if I'm right about it. I know it's from something that I recognize, but I do not know what that is. Uh, so I'm going to say Assassin's Creed until someone corrects me or agrees with me. That is a slow-ass bullet. Let's get back over here and see what goodies we can pick up. Uh, what's the one? Well, I can play this Wolfenstein game. I'm not going to do it this time because it's dull. It's too slow and I'm bad at it, so it's not interesting to see me win it. Might be something I want to do it off camera a few times to like, learn. <laughs> the, the, sort of the massive difference in the way the playstyle works is very major contributor to how difficult it is. The, the perspective of things moving past one another is really challenging me right now. Come on, then. Where are you? Where's the shop? Okay. Um, get rid of this, just in case. Anything else? Nothing else. Are we good? We've got 3,500. We could have made the armor, but I think we might have taken enough damage to make it a bad idea. Protects you from damage. Requires time to charge. Attach two walls to set a trap. Use thrusters to dodge quickly. Press in, no. Lowers secondary ammo cost. No. Shield, please. Or I am bad at the game. We've got 50 credits left. Where am I getting all these from? So that is just straight up a shield. Don't have to use it. I'm locked in the shop. <laughs> Hate you. Push you the shopkeeper. I'm not going to. I'm not mean. Uh, and then we can go. Okay, fine. So, please load this time. Globrites nest inside a hive. Right, so it's called glob globrites. Globrites. All right, loaded. That's how quickly I expected. How quickly I expected it to load. So, uh, the fact that it didn't. If you'll excuse me for just a second, my headphones have decided to only work in one ear. I have a slightly loose connection, which I believe I've mentioned in some series or other at some point. Nevertheless. They don't tend to change if I'm not moving very much. And it has happened. Miss. Hey! Not funny. You're good. I'm looking for glob rights. Glob rights. Can hear them coming at you like a jazz hamster. Cleopatra coming. Oi! Enough of that. Cleopatra coming at you. Oh, there you are. Can I have like a water gun? <laughs> There's one thing from Enter the Gungeon that this place needs is the water gun. Because I would like to wash off all this acid every now and then. Monster closet? Find the head door. Oh. <coughs> head cannon. So head cannon is a funny word because people say it. <laughs> um, I don't quite know what it means. There's two things I feel like it could mean, depending on how you spell it. 
Uh, I've seen people spell it either with one or three N's or only two N's, right? If you spell it with two N's altogether, then what you're talking about is the way the universe existed inside your head before somebody wrote a new bit of it and, and changed the way it worked. Like, someone might say, my the, the canon in my head, basically, the, the way I thought it should be working is XYZ, which made perfect sense to me. In fact, it was my headcanon for the meaning of the word headcanon. So somebody told me that the real meaning of the word headcanon uh, was actually two ends. Headcanon, boom, which is, oh my God, I never thought of that. Brain explode, right? You know, when your mind is blown, it's a, a cannon for your head <laughs> or rather from your, yeah, your head goes boom, like a cannon. Ah! Whoa! Nearly didn't reload in time for that one. Could be more accurate, please. Tiny bit more accuracy and we're going to be golden. I don't notice, by the way, my... Um... Did you see that? Was that... Yes, it is. What is that? One of them. Right. I thought it was a, a globrise. I don't notice my circle getting any smaller when I get more accurate. That was something that I would expect to be an indication of how good I am at the game. My phone's blinking. What have you got to say to me, bro? Yikes! Why is my shield not recharging? I don't know about... I don't know if this shield is telling me something. Like, do I know? Is that, the, is that it? Was that it? I don't know. <laughs> Game! All the blinking lights and, and noises are very, very helpful when I know what they mean, but I, I don't. And the little picture of the shield does not appear to have changed, if you don't mind me saying so. so. I've got a blue key card, so I'm going to guess that was the door. I think the door is a similar color to the key card, so if you are of good color vision, then well done you. Not all of us can be so blessed. And as a result, I'm not actually entirely sure whether that is the case. In this situation, I'm going to guess that the door is open. So let's find out. You don't actually have to kill everything, maybe. You just have to open it with the correct key card. Ooh, didn't see those. Can you not? Did you shoot your, your so-called friend? The friend. How about this? Just yeah. Seriously? The only shot that could have hit once you'd emerged from the door from behind the pillar, you just trying to shoot the pillar with. Every single other shot, which was perfectly on target, had he been there, you missed him. I heard a noise I didn't like. <laughs> Wee. Oh, didn't appreciate that. Oh, I overcompensated and then you missed anyway. Okay. I mean, I'm putting the enemies in the circle and pulling the trigger. You're supposed to do the rest, okay? I need you to work with me, character thing. I think my shield is helping, but I honestly do not know. Saving Private Ryan guy again. What is this? Let's use it. Find out. I can reset it because I know where the thing is. I've already found the thing. Although there is some gunk in the way of my thing. Give me that back. Reload this. Now there's more shots in it. Makes me wonder whether I wanted to do... Oh, I didn't check which flipping face to pick up. Just pick one. <laughs> Will do. Remember about that. That could be helpful. If we got the right one, well done. And if we didn't get the right one, we can see. Oh, I forgot that you had to look. <laughs> you know, pay a little bit of attention to the environment that you're in. Ugh, what are you talking about? It's not this game. Not that dude. 
Go away. Head. Oh, that was a bad guess, but okay. I mean, this wasn't a bad guess. What am I supposed to do? It wasn't an estimation, you know? I didn't put some choice into the matter. I just picked one. I don't know what that was, but it looked okay. I haven't fired my gun yet, so I don't know if it's <laughs> better than it was. Maybe. I don't know why I took that damage. I, I thought there was scrap in there. I might have picked up some scrap. I think it made a scrap noise, but I, I sort of stopped paying attention. I'm not quite sure. Uh, Headman, what are you? Is that what you things look like, huh? Weird, grossy stuff growing out of you. Not you. Tried you. You are a baddie. You. What sort of head are you? Uh, I don't think so. Pretty sure the person was bald and also brown. So, have an alternative? Yes. Yes, this is the person. Although, I mean, half your head is missing, so it's hard to say that you're bald because I can see your brain. <laughs> it's a good thing the person whose head I need is dead. And we may come back here for HP. Just before we leave. Oh, this is close. Last time we had to deal with this sort of situation, it was a ball like getting there. Our rate of fire is quite low. Which is concerning me. Please. Why? <laughs> Why are you so hard at this? Why are you so bad? Ah! <laughs> right, okay. That was a horrible place to put that thing. Never do that again. Thank you very much. Come on, then. Nice. We've seen this unit before. Weapon might actually help us out in this last little bit. Let's get through it. Yeah, we have. Alright, nice. Uh, excuse me, princess. Nobody invited you. Anymore? Right, right, right. Let's go and get that HP. We've done really, really well on this run, I think. And if it all screwed up now because of a glitch, I will be sad. I'll be very sad. Uh, we have 5,300 scrap, which is not enough to make anything that I particularly want, although we are kind of low on ammo, because none of these flipping monster closets has given us any ammo. Uh, so now we have 110 HP, which is outrageous. That's freaky as heck. What is happening? <laughs> uh, we m maybe we should fab some ammo. Let's do that. Because we want to make sure we're on a little bit of a steadier ground for the next level, which is going to be harder, considerably. I think my phone's flashing because of emails. Jen's giving me this thing where it's a link to Google Maps. <laughs> and um, it, it's showing me her position on her own maps because she's using maps. I mean, she probably knows the way home by now, but oh, we should have done that. Well, we could do that one as well. Let's just do a lot of that. Um, can we get more? Yes. All right, cool. That's plenty of ammunition in my opinion. Uh, so, uh, but it's so... Oh, it's kind of creepy watching this unit of... person. Like It's a little dot on the map, but it moves at the speed of a gen car going down the motorway. But when you're in a gen card going down the motorway, it's a very different kettle of fish from watching it move at sort of relative... It's a speed not relative to real life. It's weird. There you go. Is anything down there? Some scrap and a gun. Nice. I don't know what gun it is, but I keep pressing R as if I'm going to be able to reload half of these things. Unlikely. What are you? Um, like watching a person traveling at 70 miles an hour relative to a map at scale kind of weird and uh, like if you did it on a film or as a 
you know, as a, a representation, like when you watch the aeroplane go across the sea when you're actually on an aeroplane. Sure, a little bit of... If it's you, maybe, you can see yourself travelling, but watching somebody else... I don't... Where is she? Halfway here, since I last looked. So in the time we've done this level, I haven't even got a thing to put in. Forgot about this. So that's still there. Have I been building this? I'm, I'm honestly not sure if this is saving my progress. I guess so, because there's only one piece per level, right? Right? Uh, a maximum of one piece per game. So if there's more than one piece to put in, it's not going to work. So pick this up. Put it in there. Stand back. gonna use my uh, found weapons for now because I want a little bit more of an advantage against enemies that I'm not really very familiar with. Stop! Leave me alone! Why won't you die? I like you should be dying. You're a very difficult enemy, and you are not dying. You did die eventually. I honestly thought that nothing I was doing was having any effect. A nice thing about um, slightly... I won't say realistic, but you get the idea. This is not a very realistic game, but the, the principle of the game is a little more, real, bit more realistic than, for example, The Binding of Isaac, which is usually where I go to for comparison on this, because it's something I'm more familiar with. But even if you think about... Like Enter the Gungeon, for example, the the style and the you know the premise and all that. So, I mean, the premise of this is a bit off the charts, but it's not it's not even feasible, right? It's just a, a story about um, a, a destroyed, crashed mining ship or like a scrap merchant uh, recovery ship. Yeah, interesting. Um, yeah, that's probably the sort of thing you could see Earth eventually getting at some point in the future. These things rush occasionally to the side. It's like a, their own little dodge roll, I guess. I'm recognizing this may be a rocket launcher. Probably not the right time to use it. Very good. Very good. Not very good. Two shots when they've gone red. I think that's on purpose. Yeah, there is. Yikes! Woohoo! <laughs> oh, hoi, hoi, hoi. Keep it going. Very good. Uh, next weapon. Nope. Empty, 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 empty. I'm concentrating, in case you're wondering. I'm still here. And I'm so glad we don't have to talk to people on the telephone anymore. How about that? Remember the old days when it's like, hello, are you still there? When the other person goes quiet? Who cares? And it's an IM conversation. The person, it'll say, other person is typing. If other person is not typing, they're probably not there. And you can wait. I think I might have told everybody about our, uh, our deal. The, the deal with Jen. Where if we're using text by any form, uh, usually Discord, we're not allowed to expect an answer. So no panicking. I mean, anxiety is a big deal, right? Everyone gets it, but some, some more than others. And for some, it's a big problem. How long do I have? Quite a long time. I'm guessing I'm going to need that. Nice and uh, let's have an idea of the timing involved in that. Are you thinking this is a lever I can pull? Don't believe it is. That was good. Doing alright, doing alright. Don't jinx it, but we're doing alright. Um, I used to get really anxious. Because she would stop talking on, you know, Discord or whatever, and I'd be like, what's happened? <laughs> what happened is she's done literally anything other than pay rapt attention to your conversation, and that's perfectly allowed. Chill the heck out. I'm shooting you in every possible place except the same place twice. 
Um, so, if something's urgent, we phone. Uh, that's okay. I don't mind phoning people who I'm very familiar with, very much used to, like Jen. But I do mind phoning people who have no business being even requesting a phone call, right? Uh, I hate being on a tech support phone call on either end. I've been on both ends of a tech support phone call. Um, I don't really want to phone my parents. <laughs> I don't want to phone... I mean, who else is there? Right? Okay, so I need to put this somewhere, but I have yet to figure out where. So let's find... Oh, I haven't been this way yet. Never mind. Uh, I, I don't want to... I want to call my office to say I'm sick or that I'm going to be late or anything like that. Uh, I don't want to call people who I was expecting to have shown up by now and who haven't. I can see you. Have any of my actual weapons got actual ammo in them? That's the real question. What the heck is down here? I have ammunition for my even just this weapon. That's too much size. So some of those uh, ghosty things aggro themselves and other ones you have to shoot. Interesting. But oh, I'm so glad because when I was at university, well, when we were both at university, but I haven't introduced the other person in the scenario, which is my girlfriend at the time. She was in France and I was in England where I belong. So she was doing one year of university in France, which is fine. She's allowed to do that. Uh, but oh, the... Preview window on the corner on the corner of my eye and scared me. Um, oh heck! And that was worth it. I think sometimes just getting these weapons out is definitely worth the, the effort. And of course, if we can, hello. <laughs> You're using that too, are you? Uh, yeah, if we can get through a wave without befalling too much harm, without the harm befalling us. That was the first time something horrible has happened to me, quite frankly. Oh heck, he says, and then immediately gets set upon by these, by this pod here. This hive. One of these has ammo. None of these has ammo. This one has ammo. There we go. Ooh, we have run out of... We actually started taking HP damage for the first time. Ooh, a long time. Which probably spells doom for us now because... Uh, yes, I see you. You explode. <laughs> Very fun. Nice. Good job. Uh, let's get this out. Let's get this out. Bring it over here. It's not too far away. Nice. 666 barrels. Are you joking? Also, I'm going to go through there. I grab anything that's listening. Our accuracy is still terrible, by the way. I dodged those, and you're probably thinking, what a legend. So am I. Didn't mean to. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ow. We do still have this shield, which I'm not entirely convinced about the efficacy of, but it's here. It says it does work, so I'm inclined to believe it for now, but I think I'm going to need a little bit more, um, a little bit more proof, honestly. Hello, Wasteland. Why are you another thing? What is happening? Stuck. Where's that rocket launcher gone? There it is. Oh. Just tank it. There we go. Oh my god. Leave me alone. Ah! Where did you come from? I've killed everything back here. What are you doing? <laughs> It's not allowed. Right, good. Uh, we took a lot of damage just now, and we're going to die. <laughs> well done, me. 
try and get through here without taking any more damage and hope to goodness that one of these something will drop or already have in it from HP. Nothing is following me, which is a mercy. I nearly stood on that acid. Oh god. This is not the weapon to fight these things with. I can see you. Oh my god. I didn't know that was there. <laughs> Why have you got goo in you? Now what am I supposed to do? Oh my god. <laughs> no more? No more. Why do you just run down these cliff sides? Like it's... I mean... Nobody... Just... Just don't. We used to spend ages talking on the phone because she was in France. <laughs> uh, and I wasn't. That seems fair. Um, it was the first time we used Skype, just in general. As it was when Skype was new, like as a concept. Watch out for acid. Puddles of orange acid will hurt if you walk in them. Yes, yes, they will. Got exactly six thousand scrap, which is perfect. We have made it further than we've ever made it before, just by talking about whether or not we should be on the phone. Which uh, I am outraged by. <laughs> what is this? What? I want to open this, but I. There must be some trophies, right? Ah, oh, three minutes. Headshot 24. 51% hit rate. That's because of the terrible shot that this person is. Um. Let's just... Just sneak through here. If nothing shows up, and I don't have to shoot anything, and then we're golden, right? This is the second stage of this part where we have never been before. We have never seen this area. I'm inching my way forwards, <laughs> terrified of anything that could possibly be before me. I know how to deal with it. Don't worry about it. I can see you. That was actually... I, I actually did that on purpose, avoiding that unit just now. Can we stop? Please. Can we talk about this shield that I paid for? W what is it doing? Is it helping? I don't think it's helping. Um, that was a monster closet. Now, flooding me with monsters! Where did you come from? I know, monster closet. Discuss this. Oh, my brain. Down here. Nice. The ammo is critical right now. Please. I can't even get a 51, more than 51% head, uh, head, headshot, actual shot rate. No, my, my hits are not hitting. I, I would like more of an opportunity to damage these enemies. Yeah, you just opened up. You didn't even ask me. I mean, when they do hit, they devastate, which is fine, because I'm only hitting half of them. I think that's a pretty good way of dealing with them. Shoot them once, and then st at that point, they are guaranteed to aim directly for you. So you don't need to worry too much about EG. Nope. Shoot them a second time. I think I got that thing. Oh my gosh. You, why? Just everything go. <laughs> There's too many things. All the creatures, be gone. Ooh, hello. More ammunition for more weapons. The weapons everywhere. And Naria dropped a drink. Scry! Hello. I see you there. But, uh, 6,000 scrap well spent, I think. I'm sensing monster closets. Um, the floor is covered in spiderwebs. It doesn't fill me with joy. Or even any particular amount of... Uh, happy. I don't think this is going to be a happy place to be. Why is there big noise? Do 
Yikes, there you are. That made me jump. That definitely made me jump. A little bit more care. A little bit more aim. A little bit more actual railgun. Seems to have made a big difference to this. Uh... Hey, what? Am I getting stuck? I might have been getting stuck. There we go. So can we talk about this uh, shield? <laughs> I might have to check the wiki for it. Because it does not appear to be doing what I would like it to be doing. I think I heard one of those things that attacks me. I don't know. Please, just some health. King doing for a health back. Shop. What? That was my shield. Did you see the shield? It had an effect. I think it protected me from. Hello? Protects me from one damage. What are you doing? Is that yours? What is this? I have no idea. <laughs> it's just a little robotic quest marker. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. No more, Mr. Cleeky. No shooting in the shop. I am protecting the shop, man. What is a shop? A real shop? Oh, I'm so happy. Please give me something that I want. Display only. Old E, no. Oh, as additional, maybe double jump. A nice new teleporter part. Too late, mate. Yeah, you should cower. Let's buy this. It's display only. We got we got one, and we didn't even unlock exit. Interesting. I mean, I don't know if what I bought was any good. I'd rather have just picked up HP. I'd very much like this game to be the sort of game where HP comes in shots. More rockets. Hey, what was that? Number five? Four. Just tread carefully. There's no need to... That is the exit right there. You seen that? I'm not even going to go up there, am I? I'm just going to leave. Let's move on. Can we go out? It will let us out. Yes, perfect. Oh, amazing. Uh, not much scrap. Skateboards are removed. You'll buy ion tanks. Rip one out and place it on a rock slide to blow up. Yes, so no. uh, I don't like the noises. And this is the furthest we've ever got. And I'm a little bit... Uh, a little bit trepid about this. I would like some... Oh. Well. We're stuck here now. No way to the other side. So I guess we're just going in here. This has made it significantly more difficult. Because now I can't see. <laughs> Bad enough. Uh, when I could actually see what was coming at me. A boss fight maybe? Is this the first kind of... We're going to have to deal with the boss fight. And also, sort of mixing up the Icarus and the landscape, that's interesting. If we have to deal with the boss fight, and it's this far into the game, and therefore I have to learn its patterns, and then immediately die, and then still make it back this far to be able to learn its patterns a second time. It's going to be mildly peeving, I'll be honest, but we're not there yet. Could simply be not what I just said. So let's look forward to it not being that. The fact that there are no enemies is... Freaking me out. <laughs> Can we please make this game harder than it already is? Rather than just not having anything to shoot and being a, a horrible, scary canyon with absolutely nothing in it. What was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? I know it was a monster closet, but... Aha! Oh, hello! Oh, hello! Where did you come from? Another monster closet, no doubt. Oh, you probably came from a landslide. I thought you were supposed to shoot whenever I shoot, not just sometimes. I should really get rid of the guns that don't have anything in them. It's not this one. Not this one. Not this one. Yep, this one. 
Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, Gangnam Style. Just, just get rid of him. Make sure we can get rid of him. It is actually shooting again. What? You got owned, bro. Don't even mess. Don't even try me. Hello. I just need something to hit. <laughs> really, really hard over the head with this. Okay? Just come out and get me. Where are you? Cowards. Jump, cowards. You're only going to scare him, man. Right, we got rid of all. Oh god! That makes everything so much easier. Please can we have some more of those? <laughs> rocket launchers, I mean, not the baddies that are made easy by them. Fewer of the baddies made easy by rocket launchers somewhat removes the necessity for the rocket launcher in the first place, as you can imagine. But if there have to be those really annoying things that greet you at the start of this whole area, then. Please, can we have rocket launchers with which to deal with them? Or grenade launchers, I'm not surprised. Would also be... Uh, ...useful. Did you see that? Because I did. Oh, what? More. Where did you come from? <laughs> I, I poked one of these and it turned out to be a rock full of them. One of them. And I... Huh? Is that normal? Poke another one? That one doesn't seem to be one. Stop moving, you freaky corpses. Stay dead. One death, one death. That's all. <laughs> okay. I'm sure you'll come and find me eventually. Dum-ti-dum. Probably this way. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, oh, oh. I'm trying to go generally downwards, but it does not appear to be working out that way because. There we go. Night! Whoa, hello. I was reloading, so don't jump on me when I'm reloading. It's very rude. But it was in the Geneva Convention or something. I guess it's only a convention. See, it starts to run away. Oh, like, yeah, you bloody well run away. Turned around again and came back though. Probably like a Russian commandant behind it or something. Forcing it back to face the enemy. You coward. Dishonorable discharge. No no real burial. Something like that. More damage. These upgrades are few and far between recently. I heard the pewing noise of something that scares me. <laughs> Whoop! Hi. Thank you. Do appreciate those uh, elevators that do not also kill you. Keep going. Yes. Sounds like I'm training the dog. Keep going. You can do it. Ah, uh, this is not fun. There's an exclamation mark on the wall. I think it's just goop, but it looks kind of cool. Uh, that's freaky. We go. Um, give me that. I know I've got all these extra weapons, but I feel like I'm doing well enough with the railgun for now that maybe holding off on switching it up might be the best course of action. Because, although I might change up for this thing. That's not where you are. It's this one. <laughs> As you well know. There we go. Make sure those are taken care of before you try and do anything else because they're just going to cover the ground in goo and attack you at the same time with yet more goo. Uh, it's it's kind of gross and really not worth discussing. Honestly, I'd rather not. So, Oh, heck. Food. We need all of it. 
We've done really, really well to get back to full or nearly full HP from having had such a catastrophic um, first part of, of this chapter. And so we've got this far and still not actually had to fight a stupid boss with stupid patterns that we don't understand. So it's an hour long episode, so obviously anyone who has looked at the time before they started watching it is going, what has he done? Uh, but yeah, you know, good news everybody. We are getting good at this game. Right, let's, um, let's blow this up. And then anticipate bad news bears. We only get four opportunities to get down here with this thing. I've got plenty of time. It really starts making a right noise, but <laughs> I don't think it's necessarily worth the... Uh... I feel like it's a little bit overdramatic. It's not going to explode quite as quickly as it sounds like it is. Still clinging to the ceiling, huh? Despite all this. Where did it go? There it is. That is a rate of fire upgrade. Most enemy attacks can be avoided by strafing strategically. We can afford this. We can also not afford anything else. Oh. Uh, we're going to have to be very careful about our Game Boy. Fall out of juice. Game Boy is. Oh, that's a shame. Um, plug it in then. How far have we got? How much game is there? Uh, we're very low on ammunition. Why is there an enemy outside the gates? That's what you get. One. Two. Three. Three. So that's the number of extra shots you get when... I understand now. Press one, I'm sure. When you fire, the number around it is the number of extra shots you get from the thing that we bought that gives us extra shots when we fire. Yeesh. There we go. You are dead. Uh, I don't really know which weapon to use. Probably a shotgun because we're going to be up close soon. Probably. Maybe. There's more of this damn ravine as well. We don't know this area well enough to really have an idea of the shapes of the parts that have made that make up the uh, the level. So we're we're winging everything. <laughs> Every single thing is basically new to us right now. Oh my god! Prize. Thank you. Is it my birthday? What is this? What is wrong with you people? Oh, probably. We could have bought a thing! No! Okay, fine. Let's go and enjoy our surprise. <laughs> I've only got five shots for this shotgun. Maybe we should do something else. Not the grenade launcher. Not this. Probably this. What is this place? Two coins. Ooh! Blessing dispensed. I've got one coin. Well, we figured out what the coins are used for. Let's have a look. Should be quite powerful. Notice how the shield is lit up compared to the, um, the extra shot thingy, right? What? <laughs> what is happening? The shield is lit up and the, the passive item, the extra shot item, is not lit up. It's just to me that we can tell when our shield is ready based on whether it's lit up or not but until recently we've not been able to tell whether it's lit up or not because we don't have that sort of passive knowledge about the game just yet although now we do right uh i'm looking for just any sort of extra secrets why do what is this surprise is this every time like do you remember the the first time we found that glitch shop and we we're like is this normal <laughs> every it was not every time i don't think i've found it since have we had it more than once i don't think so Nice. Oh, nice. I think we're back on the territory of 
enemies that come from the ship. Well, mind you, I guess we've had the, uh, the the basic enemies coming out of those monster closets all this time anyway, so. What is this? Another shotgun of some description. Why is it going quiet? If that happened in real life, it wasn't your computer. Do not fret. Well, like, fret for me. But it, it wasn't, uh... It was my computer glitching, not yours, so just chill out. Oh my god, where are we going? I thought that was a jammed enemy because it was red. <laughs> Why is there a jammed enemy? Nice, 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 nice. You be gone. You be gone. You be gone. You be gone. Why are you not dead yet? There we go. Help. Good three. There we go. I want to know what this is. It's food. Because uh, we have 110 max max HP, I can take HP at 93 without feeling like I'm wasting any. I can't believe how much we turn this around, honestly. There we go. Uh, we were at death's door. We were literally at 6 HP, I think, trying not to step on any more goo in case it took us out. And we managed to claw it back from there. No, all the way down to here. What did we just pick up? <laughs> this? Yes. Is that going to charge the Game Boy? Can we play on the Game Boy now? This game is weird, dudes. <laughs> Friends, this is a strange game. What are you? Can I have your weapon? Everything's charging at me. I've not used the map since we left Icarus. What would I use it for? It's already confusing enough when there's basically a flat level and these ones are not flat at all. Excuse me? Nice. Where am I going? Give me your rifle. It's better than mine. <laughs> Shouldn't be allowed. Enemies should not have better weapons than me. Swim around here a little bit. See if we can find some goodies. We have not got much ammunition for anything right now. We really, really, really need a monster closet to pay out for us. I'm kind of thinking that our primary weapons ammunition sort of cash. Hey, help! It is more valuable to us right now than all of our secondary weapons. I'm going to use these. Just because they have ammo. And if I run out, I can throw it at somebody and get a new one later. Whereas... Running out of my railgun when I'm at you know, close range as well. I think that's the thing. Running out of the railgun at close range. It's a waste of the railgun's ammo because it's harder to hit at close range. Right? Make sense? Where am I going? What am I doing with myself? Oh, help me. What a mess. What an actual mess. I don't know how to get any further, to be honest with you. Maybe that door's finally opened. the pool? I mean, can we just stay here? Why am I even trying? This seems like a perfectly sensible place. We just need a little bit of a you know, viscera cleanup deal thing going on. And then what's that? No, we're, we're, we're grand. I wonder how close Jen is. <laughs> is that it? Is our surprise finished? Everything turned on. Oh, there's a button. <laughs> Push the button, huh? I'm gonna let things get close and then shoot them. Because I'm more likely to get value out of the shotgun! That way. No! The shotgun ran out and I was trying to get value out of it and we didn't! Unfortunately. <laughs> I didn't lock the coin. I, I know I spent a couple of coins trying to get this far, but I didn't unlock one. How much more progress did we make? I got a refund on my coins, so that's all right. I think next time maybe we just don't spend them. Let's see where Jen got to. She's like around the corner. I mean, I think she's literally... Oh no. Yes. 
Navigating the roundabout at the top of the road. So this is a good time. Thank you for watching. It's been a really long episode. We've done really, really well. And I don't think I'm going to be able to do that again. So until next time, I do appreciate all your attention because I am a sucker for it narcissistically. And then until the next time, thank you for watching. And I will see you.